Navigating the world of foreign bank transactions can be challenging, especially if you are unfamiliar with the language. Swift code is one of the most important terms you'll come across. This video will cover Swift codes, how they work, and why they're vital in international bank transactions. One, what is the Swift code? A Swift or Bank Identifier Code, BIC, is a standard format for business identifier codes. It is used to identify banks and financial institutions worldwide. The Swift code, which consists of 8 to 11 characters, uniquely identifies a bank and facilitates international payment processing. 2. Structure of Swift code. A Swift code is made up of multiple components, each containing specific information. A bank code. The first four characters identify the bank. They are typically abbreviated letters from the bank's name. A BB. Country code. The following two characters represent the country where the bank is located. C. Location code. These two characters identify the bank's headquarters or a specific branch. D. Branch code. The following three characters, optional, identify a specific bank branch or office. For example, the SWIFT code for a Barclays branch in London might be Barts GB22. Bark symbolises Barclays, GB is the country code for the United Kingdom, and 22 is the London location code. 3. Why SWIFT codes are important. SWIFT codes are critical for international transactions, since they ensure funds are transferred to the correct bank and branch. They help to streamline the process of transferring payments across borders, decreasing the possibility of errors and delays. With SWIFT codes, international payments would be significantly faster and more prone to mistakes. 4. How to find a SWIFT code. There are various ways to find a bank's SWIFT code. A bank website. Many banks publish their SWIFT codes on their websites, usually in the area dedicated to foreign payments. B. Bank statement. SWIFT codes are commonly found on bank statements. So A. Customer care. Contact your bank's customer care to obtain the SWIFT code. D. Online databases. Websites such as SWIFT.com and BankCodes.com offer directories of SWIFT codes. 5. Use SWIFT codes for international transfers. When making an international bank transfer, you usually need the recipient's SWIFT code, bank account number and bank name and address. The correct SWIFT code guarantees the funds are correctly routed to the recipient's bank. 6. SWIFT's role in international banking. SWIFT, Society for Worldwide Interbank Financial Telecommunication, is a network that allows banks to securely and reliably send and receive information about financial transactions. It is not a bank, but a messaging system enabling international payments. 7. How SWIFT works. When you transfer an international payment, your bank transmits a SWIFT message to the recipient's bank. This message contains transaction details such as the amount, currency, and the recipient's account information. The SWIFT network securely transfers this information, allowing both banks to process the payment swiftly. 8. Fees and process times. International bank transfers. Utilizing SWIFT codes may incur costs, which vary depending on the banks involved and the amount transmitted. Additionally, processing timeframes can range between one and five business days. Check with your bank for specific costs and processing times. Nine, alternatives to SWIFT codes. SWIFT codes are the most frequent technique for international transactions, but there are alternatives. A, IBAN, the international bank account number, IBAN, is mainly used in Europe and consists of the bank code and account number. B, SEPA. The single euro payments area, SEPA, enables rapid and safe payments inside the Eurozone via IBANs. B. Payment services, online services such as PayPal, TransferWise and Revolut, provide alternatives for international money transfers, generally with reduced rates and faster processing times. Twaum, security and fraud prevention, SWIFT codes improve the security of international transactions by guaranteeing that monies are transferred to the correct bank. However, it is critical to remain watchful against fraud. Verify the recipient's information before transferring funds and utilize secure banking channels to avoid scams. 11. Common issues and troubleshooting. Contact your bank immediately if you need help with an international transfer, such as delays or inaccurate transactions. They can help trace the transaction and correct any mistakes. You avoid frequent errors such as erroneous SWIFT codes or account numbers and supply proper information. To summarize, understanding SWIFT codes and their importance in international bank transactions is critical for anyone involved with cross-border payments. They provide a secure and efficient method of ensuring that monies reach their intended receiver. Knowing how to discover and use SWIFT codes allows you to perform international transactions with confidence and ease. If you enjoyed this video, please like it and subscribe to our channel.